Hey what's up guys it's Casey here welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to go from this to this. So I have a few videos on this topic but each one I explain things a little better and some more helpful tips so if this helps you out make sure to like and subscribe and yeah let's get right into it. Alright so the first thing you want to do is go to Roblox player and then open file location right click open file location then right click open file location again and make sure you do everything exactly like I do or it won't work make sure you like get all the text right um, now we're either gonna drag down and right click and do new or just hit new here then folder and do client settings exactly how I typed it I'll double click now go to view and then show then make sure these bottom two are checked, file name extensions and hidden items. So after that, um, you wanna go to new and then text document and call this client, client app settings, just like that. Now double click and then paste this into here. And you want to find out what the refresh rate on your monitor is, what um, how many hertz your monitor can display. So you want to go here. Now you can uh, probably just like Google this or something if you can't find it through here, but uh, you you should be able to. to. Uh, so once you're on here, go to Advanced Display, and then you'll see right here I have 75 hertz on my monitor which isn't very good, so you probably have a better one than me. Put whatever number is here, you know, you it doesn't have to be exact. You can put like 300, it won't really affect anything, but there's really no point in putting a number above um, how many hertz you have. And I also don't put any like um, points in there, just round it up, so I'm gonna do 75 but you know, you might have 144. I would put 75 in here since I have 75 hertz on my monitor, which is the same thing as frames per second. But just to make the thumbnail look better, um, you know, 75 isn't very impressive since I have a bad monitor. So I'm just gonna put 300 in here, but like I said, put whatever number your uh, hertz on your monitor is. So now go to file, save as, and then click right here, delete the txt, and do gson, just like that. Do save, exit out of here. You can delete this text document. And now we go to Roblox and we play a game. We should have over 60 frames per second unless your mon unless your pc doesn't like even reach 60 frames per second um when you're playing roblox it won't really do anything uh but yeah as you can see i'm uh reaching 300 frames per second but i actually am only seeing 75 on my monitor since that's as high as my monitor refresh rate goes which I did not explain in my last video. Um, so yeah, but you can put whatever number you want, but it might be a little buggy if you um, put like a really high number, it's just unnecessary. Um, but anyways guys, thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.